Did you know that each of your fingers, except your thumb, has three tiny bones known as phalanges? That's right. Your fingers are a complex arrangement of 14 bones. Each finger contains three of these bones, while your thumb makes do with just two. These bones are connected by joints, giving your fingers their amazing flexibility. The three main joints in each finger are the metacarpophalangeal, or MCP joint at the base, the proximal interphalangeal, or PIAP joint in the middle, and the distal interphalangeal, or dip joint closest to the fingertip. But these bones and joints don't work alone. Ligaments and tendons play a crucial role too. Ligaments connect bone to bone, keeping your joints stable. Tendons, on the other hand, connect muscle to bone, enabling the movement of your fingers. So, these tiny bones and joints, along with ligaments and tendons, work together to make your fingers flexible and strong. Have you ever wondered what makes your fingers move? It's all thanks to some special muscles in your forearm. Now, these aren't like the muscles that bulk up your biceps or triceps. These are smaller, specialized muscles designed specifically for the fine movements of your fingers. They're connected to your finger bones by thin, flexible cords called tendons, like little puppet strings. When these muscles contract, they pull on the tendons, causing your fingers to bend or straighten. There are two main types of these muscles, flexor muscles, which bend your fingers, and extensor muscles, which straighten them out. Thanks to these muscles and tendons, your fingers can perform delicate tasks like writing or playing an instrument. Your fingertips are super sensitive and they have a unique pattern that no one else in the world shares. How fascinating is that? This is because the skin on your fingertips is teeming with a multitude of sensory receptors. These tiny yet mighty receptors give us the ability to sense and differentiate between various textures, temperatures, and levels of pressure. Now let's talk about those unique patterns, your fingerprints. These intricate swirls and loops are not just for detectives to solve mysteries, they serve a crucial role in enhancing our sense of touch and grip. And what about those hard shields at the ends of your fingers? Yes, we're talking about your nails. They're not merely there for you to paint or trim. They protect your sensitive fingertips from injury and even assist in grasping or picking up small objects. So your skin, fingerprints, and nails all have important roles to play in your fingers. Now, let's dive into some fascinating finger facts. Did you know that fingers have the most sensory receptors? That's quite the surprise, isn't it? And here's another mind-blowing fact. Our fingerprints, those unique swirls and lines on our fingertips, are formed before we're even born and stay the same throughout our life. So, your fingerprints are as unique as you are. Isn't it amazing how much there is to learn about our fingers? So, let's summarize what we've learned today about our amazing fingers. We've discovered their complexity, from the 14 phalanges and their joints, to the muscles that allow them to move. We also touched on their sensory abilities and unique fingerprints. Remember, every time you use your fingers, you're relying on a beautifully intricate system of bones, joints, muscles, and skin. Isn't that amazing?